Aloha, welcome to Oahu and welcome to Hawaii's only TV news for visitors, the Wear TV Hawaii Weekly Update. I'm Gina Manjeri here to tell you about all sorts of things going on around town this week. First is Where to Go, an overview of events and activities all around Waikiki. Next is the weather and surf reports. If you miss any part of this broadcast and want to catch it again, it repeats all day, every day, about every two hours. This week, come and celebrate the opening reception of the sixth annual Celebration of the Arts, Hawaii's Modern Masters. The event takes place this Thursday evening at Luxury Row in Waikiki. Enjoy the finest in art and fashion. Meet award-winning local Hawaii artists as well. The event begins at 6 p.m. and the exhibit will be on display throughout November. Call 808-971-9011 for further details. As the sun begins to set on Waikiki Beach, come and enjoy Hawaii's authentic dance, the hula. Dancers perform weekly at the beautiful Kuhio Beach Hula Mound. The show includes authentic Hawaiian music and hula performances, as well as a torch lighting ceremony. That's every Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday night, weather permitting. The Hula Mound is on Waikiki Beach along Kalakaua Avenue near the Duke Kahanamoku statue. The fun starts at 6.30 p.m. Hawaii is such a beautiful place. It has inspired generations of artists. One great place to meet them, see their work, and maybe even pick out a painting or two to take home is here at Art on the Zoo Fence. It's at the Honolulu Zoo near Diamond Head and Kapiolani Park. There's everything here from oil paintings to photography and even Hawaiian artifacts. The event is every Saturday and Sunday year round from 9 to 4 in Waikiki. It's along the Honolulu Zoo fence on Montserrat Avenue. Call 808-946-4836 for more information. One place you must visit while on Oahu is Iolani Palace. As the official residence of Hawaii's former monarchy, Iolani Palace is a marvel of opulence, innovation, and political intrigue. Meticulously restored to its former grandeur, this national historic landmark in downtown Honolulu tells of a time when their majesties, King Kalakaua, who built it in 1882, and his sister and successor, Queen Liliuokalani, walked its celebrated halls. Today, you can enjoy one of the most spectacular living restorations in all of Polynesia and immerse yourself in Hawaii's royal heritage. The palace is open Monday through Saturday from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Call 808-522-0822 for more information. While there are restaurants aplenty in Waikiki, you'll also find some of the freshest and most authentic local foods at the farmer's market. Here at the Kapiolani Community College Farmer's Market, you'll find fresh locally grown produce, locally prepared raw fish called poke, and other Oahu delectables. The KCC Farmer's Market is located just outside of Waikiki on Diamond Head Road. It's open every Saturday from 7.30 a.m. to 11 a.m. Call 808-848-2074 to find out more. Discover the history of Hawaii at the Bishop Museum. Founded in 1889 by Charles Reed Bishop, the museum is the largest in the state and the premier natural and cultural history institution in the Pacific. The museum is known throughout the world for its cultural collections, research projects, consulting services, and public education programs. The museum is open from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. every day of the week except Tuesdays. Call 808-847-3511 to find out more. Win a free trip for four to Miami, San Francisco, Las Vegas, New York, or even Oahu. To enter, sign up for the e-newsletter at wheretraveler.com. You only have to register once and you're good for the entire year. Who will you take along for the ride? While you're here, why not start your day with a beautiful sight? Get up early and catch the sunrise, or head to the beach for a spectacular sunset. The sun rises just before 6.30 in the morning and sets at 6.05 in the evening. In weather, highs will be in the mid-80s, lows will be in the mid-70s, around 74 degrees. Surf along south-facing shores like Waikiki will be in the 1 to 3 foot range. North-facing shores will see swells in the 2 to 4 foot range. If you're going to be hitting the beach, always ask a lifeguard about conditions before you go in. Hawaii's waters are beautiful, but they can be dangerous. There are coral reefs lining the shores and sometimes powerful waves. Even though many others may be in the water, if you're unsure of your ability or of the surf itself, don't go in. Just enjoy the waves from the safety of the shore. Wherever the date takes you, don't forget to use sunscreen. We recommend SPF 25 or higher to protect from the strong summer sun. 
Of course, you can't take me with you when you're out and about, but there is a local tour guide with up-to-date information on where to go, what to eat, what's in store for entertainment, and other helpful tips. Look for the Wear Oahu magazine in Waikiki kiosks. Again, if you've missed any part of this broadcast and you want to see it again, it repeats all day every day, about every two hours. You can also find us on Facebook at Wear Hawaii. That's where we also have links to this broadcast, plus our Twitter and YouTube updates. You can also find out more by logging on to wearetraveler.com. I'm Gina Mangieri. Thank you for watching and aloha.